The apex body of Igbo social cultural group Ohaneze Indigbo has refuted the alleged reports of attacks on Igbo communities following the electoral violence that erupted in some parts of Lagos during last Saturday's presidential and parliamentary elections. They appealed for calm, saying what was being reported was not a true reflection of what really happened. Victor Mbadike reports. The presidential elections held on February 23 in Lagos may have come and gone. But the memories and incidences that played out in some parts of Lagos that erupted in violence is still topic of discussion. With some quarters already trading blames as to who was responsible for the violence, the apex body has played down on the reported hostility between the Igbos and the Yoruba community in Lagos. Because there are some medias I got, they say that Igbos and Yorubas are fighting in some areas, but it was not involved the Igbos, it has ethnic situation, not just Igbos, because I don't know why in Lagos State, the problem I have in Lagos as a leader is any time there is any problem between the Yorubas and any, any, any other tribe, you, the perspective from that is Igbos. The Meanwhile, they say Ohane the Indigo remains the only recognizable socio-cultural body of the Igbo. They deny any purported division in the body. Ohaneze has no true leadership in Lagos. Ohaneze has no faction in Lagos. And if you are a son, you must say, who is your father? I have used this opportunity to say that anyone that has this has problem in this election period should contact Ohaneze, not any other association. Ohaneze is where you can hear the voice of the Igbos. The Lagos chapter of the Ohanese in Digbo has called on the Igbo and Yoruba community in Lagos to embrace peace and go about their businesses. Our interest is in reassuring Ndibo in Lagos that their leadership in Lagos is on top of the situation to, and, and, and encourage them to go about their daily business. According to them, all the grey areas in the alleged breach of public peace will be addressed with a view of finding a possible solution to prevent a recurrence. Victor Mbadeke, STV News.